frequencies we thought were secure. Okay, it was like when Nikita read the West Island Harum Vegi Gatsa Shabun Futters Gishot Tola Baituk. Obviously, they were not. And you paid for it. I take full responsibility. Good. What else do you need? Of course. Now, if you want a chance to impress me and maybe get a little payback, that call I got outside was from Sheriff Daisy, the head of the marshals in Colorado Springs. She's having trouble rousting some Dorseys who have been holed up in the Garden of the Gods since their raid fell apart. Why don't you go give her a hand? New Show mission. us what Talk the Rangers can do. Don't tell. That's what I like to hear. I expect great things from you, Rangers. Do good work. All right, let's move out. Mission complete. Saved. Urunaki. Starting levels. Hmm. Hmm. Coordination. Hmm. Luck. Awareness, heat chance, strength. Speed Intelligence We have harm skills pontung. What one more thing? Big guns. Rockung it a jet. Magida jet. Neki is lett három skills pontja. First aidre. Meg a lockpickingre. Jó! Jó, na. Van mappünk is. Receive discover.
Colorado Springs. Csak level 3-asak vagyunk. <gül> Jó. Oké, doki. Granat, nice. Shmi has left weapon modung. Mi a bubánathoz lett moddingunk amúgy? Armor moddingunk van csak. Rangers, come talk to me when you've got a moment. I want to discuss staffing and recruiting, that kind of thing. Good job, Rangers. Nice to be able to hear ourselves think again. And now that it's quiet enough to talk, let me reintroduce you to the great Sergei Gretzky, who's going to be helping you with personnel. Hi again, Rangers. Damn sorry about your people. But now that you're here, we'll do what we can to get you back on your feet and find you some new recruits. Just like the Patriarch promised you. And I already got you one of the best. Meet Marcelo Gonzalez, electronics wizard, radio technician, and former dispatcher for the Marshals. He'll be your radio operator. Howdy, Rangers. Uh, while you were dealing with the alarms, I took the liberty of installing a combat AI in your vehicle. Should help you out. If you want to chat, I'll be in the operations room getting things up and running. Should be more recruits arriving soon. Ready to tell me how you want to fill out your squad? Recruiting. Uh huh. Of course. Ask away. Uh. Well. <laughs> well, Sergey won't blow his own horn, so I'll do it for him. 
He's Colorado's greatest war hero. Fought by the Patriarch's side from the beginning and saved the old man's life about a hundred times, right, Sergei? Seventy-five. Tops. Now, let me tell you about Mr. Slick here. Nobody knows the streets and alleys of Colorado Springs, or the people that live there, better than dashing Darius Kwan. You're too kind, Sergei. Yeah, I was getting a little itchy doing the same old, same old in the marshals. And retirement was driving me stir-crazy. Just sitting around listening to the paint peel. I jumped at the chance to help you folks out. That's no lie that I've been looking to leave the marshals, but you're right. That's not the whole story. The Patriarch asked me to keep an eye on you, so... Here I am. And I am truly sick of retirement. But, yeah, I'm doing the Patriarch a favor, too. Let's say... liaisons. The Patriarch wants you to succeed, and he knows it's not gonna be easy. You're strangers in a strange land. How do you, you don't know the politics. You don't know the personalities. Who hates who? Where the bodies are buried. That's where we come in. We're here to make sure you don't make too many rookie mistakes. Step on the wrong toes. And yeah, we're supposed to report back to the Patriarch about how you're doing. But you didn't really expect to be left completely to your own devices, did you? I'm not sure exactly. We came by a week and a half ago and it was stone quiet. We were gonna get the place cleaned up before you got here. But then the Dorseys attacked the city, so it got put on the back burner. Something must have triggered the security systems between then and now. Could have been anything. Not sure exactly. We came by a week and a- We were gonna get the- Something must have triggered the security system. Patriarch chased out the last big gang maybe... 10 years back? Before that, all kinds of bandits, militias, and cults have lived here since the deluge. Recently, it's been mostly outlaws and refugees. We should check around to see if there are any current occupants. Could be what set off the alarms. Around these parts, we call the nuclear apocalypse the deluge of fire, because, well, that's what it was. Noah's flood was the deluge of water. The nukes were the deluge of fire. Gonzalez? He's a whiz with stuff like that. The AI will allow you to give the vehicle orders in combat without having to be inside it. Basically, it'll become another member of your squad. Okay, what's next? My advice is to put together a squad with complementary skills. Nobody can be great at everything. So pick recruits who are good at things your current team isn't. And you can always round out your squad with folks you meet along the way. Keep that in mind when you're choosing from the recruits I've rounded up. Manage squad. Automatic weapons, weapon modding, hard as, first aid, smalling as, brawling. Ezek közül lehet válogatni. Small arms, mechanic. Level 3 mechanic. Sniper rifle, animal whispers, sneaky shit. Science. Ja, 
first aid sniper rifle, sneaky shit. Again. Big guns. Mechanic nem ártana. Van olyan mechanikunk, aki az Big Guns operál. És mi mindig tudunk. World Sea, Sniper, Small Lands, egy kell egy mechanik. Listen, I can get you all the fighting troops you need, but if you meet any talented people in your travels, don't hesitate to sign them up. Now that we've got that sorted, let's talk about the next steps. Now you're the boss here, so I'm not going to tell you what to do, but getting this place up and running wouldn't be a bad place to start. That means surveying the base and finding specialists to staff it. Perfect. That'll give you a chance to see if any of the junk around here is worth keeping before I toss it all out. After that, you might want to give Sheriff Daisy a hand. If you impress her, maybe she'll hook you up with some specialist for the base. Anyway, your call. Colorado Springs is straight out the main gate. If you want to go to Denver or Aspen, just hop back in your car and go out the way you came in. Uh... One sec. Forgive me for saying so, but I'm guessing you folks are going to need as much help in the field as you will here in HQ. So, what if I joined your squad? At least until you find your feet. Well, I know this city like the back of my hand. And this city knows me. My time in the marshals means I've got connections and trusted informants everywhere. Plus, I'm a sure shot and a decent scrapper. And... Though it hurts my civic pride to say it, there are places around here where those things might come in handy. Great. I'm at your disposal. Lead the way. The first champions are the unit. Opáčka. Mit használ amúgy? Aha, és nekik is vannak attribút pontjaik. Kérlek szépen Ő, ő sniperes
Yo. Profitch. Ja, hogy ez csak az HQ volt, és innen tudunk tovább menni. I see. I see, buddy. Hova kell nekem menni? És akkor szerintem lesz gyors utalásunk. 
Nem igazán értem ezt a mappot. Én kettővel tegyük hozzá, hogy PC-n játszottam. Need help? Talk to Jimmy Long. Make sure you take care of that bike when you get to it. That rust trap? Why? Because this was Jimmy Long Hall's. Hey Jimmy, glad to see you're okay. Dorsey's didn't get this far? Nah, they didn't bother with us. They were after folks wearing badges like yours. I would have shot those Dorseys dead if they'd walked in my garage. I haven't seen your friends before. If you folks are looking for help with your vehicle, you've come to the right place. This is the Colorado Springs Arapaho Station. We got stations all over Colorado, mostly for fixing and supplying our own fleet. But we fix vehicles and sell parts to anybody. I'm the manager, Jimmy Longhall. That's my crew over there. You need any repairs or alterations to your ride, they're the ones who will put it all together. Best crew in the business. Eh? Oh, that's Doc Parker. He needed a place to set up his clinic, and we had the space, so... Good thing, too. Those Dorseys hurt a lot of people with that little raid of theirs. We brought as many as we could in here, and Doc's been patching them up as fast as he can. Only got two hands, though. The best in Colorado Springs, no lie. He was the Patriarch's personal physician for a while. Took care of all the hoity-toits in Broadmoor Heights, too. Kind of pissed us off at the time, actually. Nice Arapaho boy taking care of the hemorrhoids of the hundred families and turning his back on his own people. Came home in the end, though. Remembered who he was and set up his clinic here. Been serving the working people of Colorado Springs ever since. Co-workers, not employees. I only give the orders because I take the orders, get me? Anyway, Fastback's the old one. Been with the station almost as long as I have. Ranch, the tall fella, thinks he's a heartbreaker, but he's the most sentimental sap you'll ever meet. And Pacer's our newest recruit. Don't mess with her. She's ten pounds of attitude in a five-pound bag. At the moment... Yeah, I guess so. Driving and wrenching has kind of become the Arapaho brand. We pride ourselves on being the best mechanics and couriers in the West. Well, except for those of us who run the stations. We mostly live on the road. The people of the convoy, some folks call us. And we've turned that way of life into a business. Arapaho service stations, Iron Thunder Logistics, Arapaho Caravan Protection, and so on. While other folks were eating each other in the suburbs or fighting over mansions in Broadmoor Heights, we kept to the wildlands and didn't come back until civilization had reestablished itself. And when Ish. we came back, we came with services people needed. Transportation, protection, and repair. Been living well ever since. Sure we do, if they're good enough. Takes a lot of skills to be better than an Arapaho, though. Anything for your vehicle. Have a look. Let's hope you got another career planned. I give it another three months before Payson leaves you in the dust. To and so what if she does? It just means I gotta work harder. Ain't no shame in that. I'm gonna remind you that you said that. You wanna 
to set your tire bead real quick and look impressive doing it? I've got a trick. Hmm? Set the tire on fire. Except don't use gasoline. Yeah, well, she's smart enough to know that. Anyway, just a quick shot of flammable agents, a method for putting out the fire, and you're ready to keep going. This here's Market Square. No time. The Arapaho Garage is just out. Hey, Doc. Quan, hope you won't take offense, but I've got no time for niceties. Dying people take precedence. Understood, brother. They're in bad shape, and I don't have the time or tools to save them. Thank you. The things I need most are a suture kit, an injury kit, and a medic pack. Got that? These folks are literally dying on us, so don't fuck around. We'll talk more when you come back. Make sure you take care of that bike when you get to it. That rust trap? Why? Because this was Jimmy Longhall's first car. When it gave up the ghost in the plains, he salvaged what he could. We've got everything the doc asked for. We should head back. All because he couldn't bear to be separated from his mission. Car's a lot like an old dog sometimes. It won't learn new tricks. What now? Finally. Get started on those patients. What now? There are people dying right here, right now, and you're trying to get me to leave? What the hell are you thinking? There are people dying right here. As long as you don't mind if I keep working while we talk. Name's Parker. Plenty of doctors in Colorado Springs. I'm one of them. Well, that doc's underselling himself as always. Ask anyone. They'll tell you. Parker's the best in town. Used to be the Patriarch's personal doctor. That would be a heck of a recommendation if you were looking for a babysitter. Just wish I had enough medicine to keep this clinic going. Running out of everything. That's an awful charitable spin on what actually happened. But I'm afraid I don't have time to tell you the real story. We used to beat each other up when we were boys. You get to know somebody pretty well when you fight them a few hundred times. Yeah. That was always Arapaho kids versus townie kids. Parker was the only Arapaho who put up a good fight. Till I grew up and hit the books. Figured I couldn't make a career of beating people senseless. Quan found a way to do it, though. Dorsey attack. Maybe you heard about it. A suture kit, a medical pack, and an injury kit. Then use them to fix up the other patients. Sure. Long as you don't mind if I keep working while we talk. Good luck. You ever hear of car gardens? You mean where they grow these fine automobiles for our personal use? Don't get cute. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, I didn't know they existed until my pa told me to go down to this old man's farm. He said he had a few cars we could take. But we didn't Oh, you want to talk to Mama? She's the one in charge. Hanging around like shrubbery in a rich man's home. A lot of folks were shot down in the street. Marshals. There's always Cleaned something. Up most of the bodies already. Did you see the Dorseys almost blow up the statue? Yeah. Wouldn't be Market Square without it. Cold and shitty day, ain't it? Jesus, loaves and fishes, Christ! That's a bomb under my stall, ain't it? Oh, shh. Holy mackerel! Better stay back from my stall. Those goddamn Dorseys dropped a landmine under it. Oh, thank God. 
You'd be doing me a shell of a favor. Wish I could get these flipper and marshals to take care of the dang bomb under my stall. Really? That's great news. Here's a little something for you. I'm back in business. Welcome to the freshly reopened Taiwan Jones's Emporium. We have every <laughs> fin you need. Just for the you didn't hear this from me, Franz. But word is, there's still Dorseys all around the city waiting to jump innocents such as yourself. Be sure to stock up with me, yeah? Ah, you want to hear about the wide open seas? My trusty vessel, the wild waves crashing the shores? Well, sorry chums, I'm just here to sell stuff. What would you like? I have no idea what you're talking about, Franz. No, nope. no, wish that I did, Franz. Born and raised in Colorado Springs. Me? I've never even seen a fish in my life. Wondrous creatures, I hear. Sardine Lee. Midwantasha. My battle rifle. Battle shotgun scout rifle hot on yards one need this one we need to scout rifle in common we a sniper rifle we need to run twenty The place is closed. Brygo wants us to stand in the cold and make sure you know it. Várjam, akkor kinél milyen fegyver van? Sűbazd meg! 
Kurva, South Rift le van nála. These marshals and Dorsey's got on them. Yeah, those marshals were colleagues of mine. I'm gonna guess you didn't kill them, but you need to put all those valuables back and walk away. Fat chance. We got guns and ammo now. We don't take orders from marshals no more. <laughs> Taking shelter. A whole lot of blood. Engaging target? Yeah, he buys it.
Alltså, jag ser att det är Hogy lehet ilyen balfasz valaki, de komolyan? What is a cow? Sok életünk maradt, de mindegy.
Az a nem volt semmi lúd. Lenne healingelni ezekkel szerintem. Hogy az nem is tudja magát gyógyítani. Picking Kellana. Shouldn't you smash me? Okay. No, darn it, Martha. Why else would I even keep a shotgun around if and I don't use it? Do you know who those outlaws are, Josiah? Consarn it. You Dorsey peckerheads, get on out of there. Hush up now, Josiah. You can't go in there alone. They'll kill you. You think I can't handle myself? I've put down worse than these in my time. Oh, since when? You've been a shopkeeper all your life. Will you help me talk some sense into this old fool? If he goes after those Dorseys, he'll get himself killed. Some of those Dorsey bastards are hiding out in my shop. My shop! Finest clothing store in the whole dang town. So I'm going in after him. They're too busy. Besides, a man should be able to protect his own shop. Oh. Thank you. Keep an old man from killing himself, will you? Killing myself? Can't you pretend to have some faith in me, Martha? Especially in front of these soldier types? You do this, you'll get a nice discount at the shop. Assuming I still have a shop by the time it's all over. Well, go on then. Manuál is nem lehet menteni egyébként. De. Ja, hogy elmentettük gyermekeim az útban, úgyhogy innen fogjuk folytatni. Ha ezt tudtam volna, köszönöm szépen, hogy itt voltatok velem. Sziasztok!